going on everybody? My name is Drew Sanford. I'm with Bass Fishing Underground. Today we're on Lay Lake in Alabama. Um, the fish are on beds. Uh, they're not hard to catch. I'm going to kind of go through a couple of the baits we throw. Um, first off, I like the Texas rig stuff. I'm using a little tungsten weight. This one, Bass, Bass Pro makes them, Strike King makes them, True Tungsten makes them. There's all different companies that make them. I'm throwing um, a 3 8 nothing special there. I'm throwing a 3 aught pretty heavy wire, Mustad hook. Um, the bait selection we're using today, you want something when you pitch it out there and you find a fish on bed, you want to see the bait. You want to see when the fish inhales it, when he eats it, what's going on. So what I'm using, I love a tube. They're easy to hook up with. Not, yeah, I mean, the fish take them and it's not any big deal to, to catch them when they eat it. Another bait is a lizard, um, and I've got two lizards I throw. I have a green pumpkin with chartreuse tail. Um, I throw that, that's probably the lizard I throw 90% of the time. But uh, the white one's good when they are on the beds and you can see them eat it. Any bright color, the fish, right now you're not trying to mimic food. You're just trying to put something on his bed to make him mad. So um, another bait that works real well is a black and blue beaver. I mean, anything mimics a crawdad. Like I said, though, it's not really about the food. It's just about getting it on the bed. You want something that whenever you throw it on the bed, you're going to hook up with them. That's the big, the, the key part with that is you don't want something that you don't have a good hookup rate. So something with a good hookup rate. So I'm going to go ahead and rig this up real fast, Texas rig. Um, I'm just putting my weight on. Just a normal bullet weight. I don't peg mine. Some people do. Um, personal preference. These have the rubber inserts in them. So it doesn't slide too terribly much, and then I just do a normal polymer knot. Just normal polymer knot. Wet your line. Cinch it all down. You want to use a pair of scissors, not your teeth, because your dentist says so. I'm going to rig up a black and blue beaver. We're going searching for them, so we just caught a fish off a of bed, and I'm about to go look for another one. So I'm going to just pitch something that we can pitch around real nice and easy and goes in and out of the grass. All right, everybody. Just your basic Texas rig beaver bed fishing. Nothing real special. Just going to get that pitching on his bed, bump it into the fish a few times, make him mad. Thanks, everybody. 